So here are the results after using the newest fast flags and the best PC optimization tweaks for Roblox. Well, in this video, I'll show you the newest block strap fast flags for 2025 that will boost your FPS, lower your ping, and make Roblox run smoother than ever on any PC. So stick with me, because by the end, your gameplay will feel brand new. Gear Up Booster is one of the best program for optimization of your ping while you playing Roblox. Using a wired or wireless connection, Get this paid program for free from my description and enjoy your game with lower ping. Step 1. Set up a tool to track your CPU. While you're gaming in Roblox. To make Roblox run smoother, we'll first set up a Windows tool that can watch how your CPU is working while you play. This helps us make sure your computer is performing at its best. Start by clicking on the Windows search bar at the bottom of your screen and typing performance. From the list of results, click Performance Monitor. When the window opens, look at the panel on the left side and find Data Collector Sets. Click the little arrow beside it to open it, then click User Defined. Right-click inside that section, choose New, then click Data Collector Set. A window will pop up asking for a name. Type Roblox Boost and choose Create Manually Advanced, then click Next. On the next screen, check the box that says Performance Counter and click Next again. Click the Add button. In the new window, scroll down the list of categories and find Processor. Choose the highest number you see. For example, if it goes from 0 to 15, select 15. Click Next, then Finish. Now you'll see Roblox Boost listed with the status Stopped. Right-click it and choose Start. This will now run in the background while you play Roblox and track how your CPU is working, so we can spot performance issues more easily. Step 2. Unlock all CPU cores to boost Roblox performance. You can get all the files from my official website. I give link in the description of this video. We're going to make sure Roblox can use every CPU core in your computer for maximum performance. Download and install a free program called Park Control. Once it's installed, open the program and choose the power plan Bitsum, highest performance. This makes your CPU stay at full speed without slowing down. Now change these settings in Park Control. Parking AC, 100% and off. Parking, DC, 100% and off. Frequency scaling. AC, 100% and off frequency scaling. DC, 100% and off. Also, turn on the option Bitsum Dynamic Boost. This makes sure your CPU cores wake up instantly when you start Roblox and don't waste time staying parked. Finally, open Windows Power Options and set Bitsum Highest Performance as your active power plan. Confirm that CPU parking and frequency scaling are set to 100% for both AC, plugged in, and DC, battery. Click. Make active, then apply to save. Now your CPU will give Roblox all the power it can. Step 3. Use the newest block strap. Fast flags to optimize Roblox performance. You can get all the files from my official website. I give link in the description of this video. Block strap lets you add custom settings to Roblox so it runs faster and smoother, especially on low-end PCs. Download the Blockstrap Launcher from the FPS Boost Pack. After downloading, double-click to install it and follow the setup instructions. Once it's installed, open Blockstrap from the Windows search bar. Inside Blockstrap, click Configure Settings, scroll down to Engine, Fast Flag Settings, and then scroll all the way to Fast Flags. Click the button that says I know what I'm doing, then click Add New. Open the text file from your FPS Boost Pack that contains the newest Blockstrap Fast Flags. These are tested settings that remove heavy graphics effects, increase FPS, and fix stuttering. If your PC is weak, they're still safe to use. Copy everything from that file, paste it into the Fast Flags section in Blockstrap, click OK, and then click Yes if a message pops up. Close Blockstrap and launch Roblox. You should instantly notice smoother gameplay and more FPS. In this step, I'm going to show you the best tool to get stable ping for Roblox. So first download the Gear Up Booster tool from the official website using the link in the description. After downloading, install it on your PC. Once installed, you'll see the Gear Up Booster interface. The first thing you'll need to do is log in with your Facebook or Google account. On the Home tab, you'll find all the games installed on your PC. If you go to the Games tab, you can browse thousands of games available for optimization. To optimize your network and FPS, return to the Home tab and select the game you want to boost. For example, I'll select Roblox. Click the Boost button and the tool will begin optimizing the game. It will automatically find the best server for you. Next, you'll need to choose your server region. Select the nearest server for the best connection. In my case, the Middle East server works best. After selecting the server, close the window. Now go to the End tab where you'll see a list of servers available in the Middle East. 
Choose the nearest one or let GearUp automatically pick the best server for you. I recommend setting it to automatic for the best results. Finally, close the window and launch your game using GearUp Booster. This will help you optimize Roblox or any other game for lower ping and higher FPS. Step 4. Use MSI Afterburner to improve GPU performance in Roblox. You can get all the files from my official website. I give link in the description of this video. We'll now boost your graphics card performance using MSI Afterburner. Install MSI Afterburner from your Tools folder. Open it and you'll see sliders for GPU settings. First, set power limit and temperature limit to their maximum values. Don't change the core voltage slider. Now slowly increase the memory clock in steps of plus 20. For example, go from 0, 20 to 40 and test Roblox each time to make sure it runs smoothly without crashing. Once you find the highest stable value, click Apply. This step makes your GPU work harder for Roblox, improving FPS and reducing lag. Step 5. Turn off Windows Telemetry for better Roblox performance. You can get all the files from my official website. I give link in the description of this video. Windows Telemetry collects background data that can slow down your system. Turning it off will give Roblox more resources. Click Apply only recommended settings to safely disable tracking features. If it asks about creating a restore point, you can skip it if you already have one. Keep in mind, this might turn off features like clipboard history or storage sense. If anything stops working, open O&O Shut Up 10 and click Undo All Changes. Once you're happy, tick. Do not show this message again and click OK. This will make Windows lighter and more focused on running Roblox smoothly. Step 6. Lower Keyboard. Input Delay. Using filter keys, you can get all the files from my official website. I give link in the description of this video. In fast Roblox games, a quick keyboard response is important will make your keyboard react instantly. Open the Filter Keys Setter program and change the settings to Ignore. Under 0 milliseconds, no delay before key presses register. Repeat delay, 130 milliseconds. Repeat, rate, 10 milliseconds. Check the box on the right to turn these settings on, then click OK to save. This will make your controls feel faster and more responsive in Roblox. Step 7. Disable HP et to stop Roblox stuttering and FPS. Right-click the Start menu and choose Device Manager. Scroll down and expand System Devices, then find High Precision Event Timer. Right-click it and select Disable. This can help reduce lag spikes and make Roblox gameplay smoother. If you follow all these steps, Roblox will run much faster, with higher FPS, less stuttering, and quicker controls. Don't forget to restart your computer so all changes take effect. If this helped you, leave a like, share it with friends, and subscribe for more Roblox performance guides.